Mississippi is seeing a significant increase in brush and wildfires. The Mississippi Forestry Commission says windy conditions are causing these fires to spread rapidly. As 12 News' Brandon Rains explains, you should be extra cautious when burning outside. It's been a hectic weekend for fire crews across Mississippi. The Mississippi Forestry Commission says more than 9,000 acres were burned. We saw a number of fires. We saw uh, probably around 147 fires this weekend. That's since Friday. And we responded to even more calls, probably over 200. While most of the fires were small, crews are still battling a large wildfire in Jefferson Davis County. The commission says the fire is around 80% contained. We have crews working to try to manage the situation and make sure they're diligent. We have people from all over the state helping on that fire, um, including MSC personnel and local fire departments. Fire crews in Jones County have been busy responding to yard and brush fires. Around 130 acres were burned and two abandoned homes were destroyed. Yesterday we had approximately 40 acres uh, burn in Soso and there were 16 to 18 houses that were in immediate danger. So um, in addition to trying to protect those structures and we have to have units and personnel dedicated to each structure to try to protect it and douse it with water. Emergency crews say high winds are causing fires to spread rapidly. They urge Mississippians to take extra precautions to prevent more fires. On Saturday, we had a structure fire in the Ruston community where embers from that fire went across the road to the back of another home across the street and started a, a yard fire. Uh, that's how easily it can happen. Just because there's no burn ban in place does not mean that you do not need to be cautious. Everyone needs to be aware, especially on those windy days about burning debris and also simple things like, like dragging chains behind the trailer, little things like that cause fires too. The Mississippi Fire Commission is urging anyone to hold off on burning if wind is present. Reporting in the Pine Belt, Brendan Rains, 12 News.